This is your Pojo News. I'm Gavin. And I'm Leslie. And now for the pledges, a moment of silence. Please stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas flag. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. And now for a moment of silence. This Friday, one lucky senior football boy will be getting pied in the face by me at the pep rally. How do you choose which football boy you want to be pied? Your options are Bryce Hollingsworth, Connor King, Speck Belay, Blake Walker, Braden Florence, Jaden Norris, Ryan Robinson, Dalton Sparks, Eli Hansen, Jeremy Morrow, Joel Bird, Oliver Hobbs, Aaron Bowen, Logan Heaton, and Hendrickson Perdomo. The football boy who collects the most money in their jar by the end of this week will be getting a pie in the face. Their jars will be set up during all four lunches and outside of the library during passing periods. Again, this fundraiser will only be today, tomorrow, and Thursday, so don't forget your money. Attention Springtown High School. The student council will be hosting a clothes drive for the month of October, just in time for you to get rid of all your old clothes in your closet. Heavy coats, long sleeve shirts, heavy socks, and pants are strongly encouraged. However, we will be accepting all clothes regardless of shape, size, or wear. Also, feel free to bring shoes and accessories. If you decide to bring socks or underwear, please make sure they are in brand new sealed packages. You are asked to bring your donations to Miss Benton's room. Once all donations have been collected at the end of the month, we will be taking them to the homeless shelter in Fort Worth. Hey SHS, fall has arrived and the temperature outdoors has changed a bit, but please remember our dress code has not changed. Please do not wear pajamas or carry your blankets to school. Here are next week's dress up days for Red Ribbon Week. Here are this week's dress updates for Red Ribbon Week. Join us as we fight to be drug free. Also, show your Pojo spirit. This Friday's theme will be Color Wars. The seniors are pink, juniors are blue, sophomores are purple, freshmen are green, and the staff and parents are orange. If your phone has been taken up and sent to the office, to go see Mrs. Gonzalez to pick it up. You need to pick it up by 4 p.m. that day. FCCLA is partnering with We Are Brothers Keeper to provide holiday meals for families in need during the holiday season. We are accepting donations of food to prepare holiday baskets for these families. There is a donation box outside of room 127, Ms. McMillian's room. Thank you for helping us make someone's holiday brighter. Do you like spaghetti? Come by Project Celebration Spaghetti Dinner and Bake Sale on November 6th from 11.30 to 3.30 at the First United Methodist Church. To-go orders are also available. All proceeds benefit Project Celebration and the Class of 2023. New student drivers, as you have begun driving to school this year, please follow these simple rules. 1. Get a parking permit sticker. Scan the student parking QR code in the glass case in the main hall outside of the student center to complete a Google form with vehicle information. Then see Mrs. Griffin to pay for and receive your parking sticker. Number 2. Do not park in the painted parking space. It belongs to a senior or junior who has paid for the privilege of parking in their desired space. Please look before you pull into an empty parking space. It may belong to someone. To new and returning student drivers, please follow rule one and rule two. And when in doubt, see Mrs. Griffin in the student center counseling office. Tickets will be issued beginning November 7th. <clears throat> Academic UIL season is here. Please join us on Thursday, October 27th from 4 to 4.20 p.m. in the library to check out our teams meet our coaches, and sign up to participate. If you have any questions, please email Mrs. Northrup or stop by room 101. Counselors are ready to start seeing our 10th graders to review their schedule for 11th grade. Students, please review your four-year plan in EduThinks tile found in your Porcupine portal. When you are finished with work in a class, please request your teacher to come see your counselor with an e-haw pass. Please bring your charged Chromebook with you. Thank you so much. And now for sports. This is the volleyball schedule for this week. Today, all volleyball teams play Castleberry at SHS at 5 and 6 p.m. And now for football. 
Thursday, October 27th, freshman and JV teams play at Burke Burnett at 5 p.m. Friday, October 28th, Varsity plays Burke Burnett at the Porky Run Stadium at 7 p.m. This has been your Poja News, and now here's Reagan with your senior news. Good morning, seniors. This Friday, seniors are asked to wear tiaras and crowns for our senior pep rally. This Friday's night game is our last home game and senior night, so everyone come out and support our seniors. The senior pep rally is just around the corner. If you're interested in participating in the pep rally, scan the QR code and watch the video to learn the moves. Senior Project Ce Seniors, Project Celebration needs your help with the spaghetti dinner fundraiser. Boys, please bring a package of dry spaghetti noodles. Girls, please bring two cans of fire roasted tomatoes. The cost is $10 per plate for pre-orders and $12 at the door. Items can be dropped off with Miss Hughes in room 120. The last day to drop off items is November 4th. For more information about Project Celebration and ways to help support, please see the senior section in the Digital Quills weekly newsletter. And don't forget, it's a great day to be a porcupine.